man feels sick after eating sushi. Then he wakes up with an arm missing in the hospital. To make your day just a little brighter, subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to be inspired by these heartwarming stories every day. Comment I subscribed and we'll feature some of you in our next video. We're all guilty of trying out new things. Not to worry, however, it's a perfectly human thing to do. Curiosity drives humanity. That's what led us to where we are today as an advanced species. But sometimes curiosity can be damning. Sometimes it costs us things we never thought could happen to us, things we only see on TV. People lose their lives because they want to try out new things and sometimes it's something so innocent as trying out a new meal, perhaps sushi. Sushi has been around for many decades now, some would say since the 60s, but up till today so many folks haven't tried sushi. You might begin to wonder why people think twice before trying out sushi. Is it because sushi is made up with several ingredients, one of which is fish and often never cooked? We've all heard tales of how eating raw meat can be damaging to a person's health. No jokes, it can be extremely harmful. Sometimes these raw meats contain bacteria that if eaten can cause illnesses and in some cases a near life-ending experience. Like a 71-year-old South Korean man came to find out. Sushi nearly caused him to pass away. But thankfully he survived, but not without a constant reminder of how that single decision he made to try out sushi after having never once tasted it for the 71 years he'd been alive could cost him something so fundamental. Mr. Gang was a man that liked his timetables. He had a timetable for everything, including the food he ate. But one morning he woke up to a craving, a craving to start doing things differently, to throw out the timetable and just start being spontaneous. And it was that spontaneity that gave him the idea to have sushi for dinner, something he'd never eaten in his life. At the end of this story, you would undoubtedly have the train of thought that would scream, how could someone get so unlucky? Mr. Gang, a man with a history of type 2 diabetes and high blood pressure, and who was undergoing dialysis for end-stage renal kidney disease, treated himself to a nice bowl of sushi at a local restaurant in the area he lived in. He enjoyed it. Unfortunately, 12 hours after attempting something new, eating sushi, blisters and bruises began to form on his hand and arm, and not long after, the hand had swollen up like it had three tennis balls hidden in it. And even worse, the hand, his left hand, started to leak from all that swollen. As described by CNN, a blood-filled cavity measuring 3.5 by 4.5 centimeters, or about 1.5 by 2 inches, had developed on the palm of his left hand, while on the top of his hand and forearm there was a swelling cavity under the skin. This led to hours of excruciating pain for Mr. Yang. In his pain, he managed to call 911 and was quickly rushed to the hospital, where he was also quickly attended to. But he didn't even need to tell the doctors the full details of his pain. As soon as the doctor heard that he'd eaten sushi, the doctor immediately knew what was happening to Mr. Yang. He was suffering from an infection caused by flesh-eating bacteria. Quickly, they rushed Mr. Yang into an available OR, which allowed them to isolate the bacteria causing the infection, a bacteria common to coastal ocean waters, Vibrio vulnificus. The doctors drained the blisters and cut away much of the infected tissue that they could, but soon after they realized nothing could be done to save Mr. Yang's hand. On the 25th day after Mr. Yang arrived at the hospital, the doctors amputated his left forearm. Coming to terms with his new condition, Mr. Yang went home relieved that all he lost was a hand and not his life. And when asked, he mentioned that he regretted not checking to see if what he was eating was safe. A warning to our viewers. Please check whatever you're eating to make sure it's safe. Did you learn something from this video? Hit the subscribe button below and do share this story with your friends and family to enlighten them about eating safely. Tap one of the videos on the screen for another amazing story. Thanks for watching. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe.